Welcome to Craft Art Sales Training. This video is designed to give you a quick 101 on why wood countertops make sense for your next design project and what makes Craft Art an industry leader. Whether you are an existing Craft Art dealer or a new prospect, we thank you for taking this opportunity to become more educated about Craft Art wood products. So why should you suggest a wood countertop to your client? Wood was the original countertop surface that holds up beautifully in today's market. Current trends embrace these natural elements. Customers today want unique pieces that set their homes apart from everyday granite countertops, but still want to feel confident that they made the right choice that will be long lasting and improve their home value. A great way to include a wood countertop in your common design equation is to convert the island to a wood island. This beautifully complements granite or stone perimeters and instantly adds warmth and prestige to your custom design. Wood works well with a variety of different solid surfaces, giving clients the best of both. For instance, if your client loves to bake, they may want marble in their kitchen to roll pastry. Combining this with wood gives them a variety of work options. As a craft art dealer, you have access to a beautiful and unique product line that sets you completely apart from the competition. All of our wood tops have the look of high-end furniture with the practicality of solid surface at a price point similar to granite and stone in most markets. So how do wood countertops compare to other surfaces? You may be surprised to find that wood is just as durable as other surfaces. Not only do we make them waterproof and stain resistant, but they are also sanitary and food safe with a natural ability to resist bacteria. Small spills and little accidents are no problem. Water, red wine, or even pasta sauce can be easily cleaned with warm soap and water. Craft Art wood countertops are completely waterproof when properly maintained. Designers love the wide variety of design options available in wood. Craft Art offers a large variety of wood species, both domestic and exotic, as well as several reclaimed options. Our top selling species are black walnut, wenge, and driftwood. Our newest species is burnt ash, which is a thermally modified product that reduces warping concerns while producing a beautiful dark finish. This would be a great choice for a vacation home. You may decide to go simple and uniform with beach, or maybe eye-catching with zebra wood. We have a color for every kitchen, and our tops are completely custom. They come in a variety of species, specialty shapes, and integrated options. We can make your island in any length or width. You're only limited by your imagination. It's important to note that craft art countertops are set apart from the competition with our full rail construction. Craft art hand picks the lumber for each job according to species, thickness, and width, and takes great pride in reserving scraps for samples, not countertops. We also believe in showing off the beautiful characteristics of wood to their fullest advantage. This includes minimizing the use of stains to hide sapwood or irregularities in the grain, as we believe these are unique characteristics that make wood beautiful. All species contain sapwood, and its most contrasting effect is exhibited in walnut and cherry, while it is least apparent in maple and beech. Knots also follow this rule. You can choose to display more or fewer knots, figuring, and general variation by your choice of construction style. Craft Art doesn't stain any of our countertops except for a few modified finishes, so pick the species that has the color that works best for you. Don't worry about matching your countertop to wood cabinets or flooring. Oak floors don't always mean oak countertops. Using the same species can be unifying, but because wood flooring is often stained and countertops are not, it is not always a guarantee that the same species of wood will match. There are three construction styles in wood countertops, plank, edge, and end. The first and most popular style is plank style. This is sometimes referred to as face grain, and these boards usually feature an open grain running parallel along the length of the top, showing off the grain to its best advantage. Swirls, burls, and knots are most prominently displayed in this style. Boards are typically three to six inches wide, and thicknesses are limited to inch and a quarter to two and a half inches thick. Butcher blocks are a wonderful example of the edge grain style, which features a tighter, more consistent grain running parallel along the length of each top, and often a slightly darker color. 
edge grain is the most stable construction style with the least amount of grain variation or not, though sapwood may still be visible. In order to create edge grain surfaces, boards, approximately inch and three quarter wide, are set on their sides and face glued together. Edge grain tops can be fabricated as thick as six inches. This is also true for our next species, end grain. Though end grain or checkerboard is the least common style, it is frequently the preferred choice for serious chefs. Due to the high waste and labor intensive process, end grain is also the most expensive choice for homeowners and the most prone to expansion and contraction issues. But don't let that scare you. End grain makes a great addition as an island or prep table. You can even mix and match species for a bold look. We already discussed that our countertops are constructed to the full length of the countertop whenever possible. Trees only grow so tall and sourcing lumber over 14 feet can sometimes be difficult, so the use of a seam may be necessary in some extreme cases. And of course, it may be necessary to make sure you can carry the top into the home. For the typical perimeter in a kitchen, you will most commonly need a joint around corners. The most popular joint is the miter joint, which allows the grain to run parallel in both directions while the boards meet in the middle for a blended look. Be aware that with any joint, there may be a slight variation in grain, color, or board width where the tops meet, as wood is a natural product with varying grain patterns. Now that you've chosen species, thickness, construction style, and joints, you may want to add a little flair to the edge with an edge profile. Every countertop comes with a softened edge called an eased edge, but we maintain three groups of edge profiles at various prices to fit any budget or design. These edges are all available in your dealer resource guide. Like any countertop fabricator, we duplicate custom cutouts to fit sinks and stoves. But what about the high-end options that make cooking that much more fun? We offer drain channels, set-down rods, and integrated knife slots for the aspiring chef. While these options serve great function for working countertops, these next two options land a little bit more on the artistic side. Our custom distressing process gives an aged, antique look to your customer's new countertops. Our craftsmen mimic a 25-year age pattern by hand for a personal antique look. Each piece is a one-of-a-kind work of art. This antiquing process is right on trend and constitutes almost 25% of craft art sales. Following that trend is the use of live edge slabs, which show off the natural edge of the tree for a rustic look. Our artisans can also simulate this edge by hand, which is referred to as our faux live edge. The final piece of the puzzle is choosing a finish option. Craft Art offers the satin waterlox finish, which results in a beautiful sheen that still complements the natural grain and color of the wood, while penetrating deep into the pores of the wood, unlike polyurethane, which sits on the surface for a glassy finish. An added benefit to our finish is that its waterproofing qualities eliminate those pesky white rings of polyurethane finishes. Waterlox is food safe when cured, but we don't suggest it for chopping surfaces to maintain that glossy finish. For chefs, we suggest the use of our food grade mineral oil. Though not waterproof or stain resistant like Waterlox, refinishing can be done as often as needed with a little sanding and a reapplication of mineral oil to maintain the proper moisture levels. It's important to note that there is no warranty provided on mineral oil or unfinished tops as craft art cannot guarantee the proper maintenance of these finishes once they leave our facility. Care and maintenance of a waterlox finish is easy. Just clean up spills with warm soap and water, then dry. Disinfect your tops using a 10% white vinegar to water solution. White vinegar disinfectants are also available pre-made in many retail locations. For heavier greases, use a soft sponge and gentle soap and water. Just as with other countertop materials, ammonia cleaners should be avoided. If you do need to refinish your countertop, we have all the resources online to help you with this process, which can easily be done at home. We suggest refinishing every three to five years, depending on your level of use, to maintain the waterproof barrier. Anyone can view these videos on our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash craftartcountertops. These finishing products are also available in specialty stores or on our website at craft-art.com. 
To understand why water and moisture management is so important to wood products, you must first know that wood is made of living straws that continue to expand and contract even after the tree is cut down. These straws swell when exposed to moisture and shrivel up when dry, resulting in an expansion and contraction perpendicular to the grain direction. To minimize this effect, controlling the relative humidity in a house between 40 and 55 percent at 70 degrees Fahrenheit is suggested for all your wood trim, doors, and flooring. This wood movement is especially important when templating between two walls. Plank and edge construction styles with grain direction running perpendicular to the walls are not a concern, as the countertops will only expand along the width of that countertop, not through the ends of the boards. This is a major concern, however, for ingrain countertops, which will need a minimum of an eighth inch in every four feet to expand and contract. Backsplashes can be installed to hide this movement, but overall we suggest ingrain for islands to ensure plenty of room to move. Never place a wood countertop directly over any solid surface without breathing holes, and be wary of older model dishwashers, fireplaces, wine coolers, or any other heat sources when designing your countertop. Once you're ready to install, be sure to either watch our installation video or read the brief installation guide sent with every top for full details if you're new to wood countertops. To highlight a few key differences in wood installation, do not use silicone or adhesives except around sinks as this prevents the countertop from being able to move. Instead, drill a simple oversized hole in the provided corner blocks and secure the top with screws and fender washers in every corner. This allows the countertop to float on the cabinet. If you make any cutouts on site, be sure to seal them with a quick swipe of water locks, which we supply with every shipment. Remember that overhangs over eight inches may need support. These supports must be screwed to the countertop to prevent curling upward. List your overhangs on your drawings and talk to your sales representative about how to best prevent issues down the road. We have a lifetime guarantee against defect in workmanship and a one-year warranty on material. Neglect or failure to follow the installation and maintenance instructions will void the warranty. Accidents do happen, however, so let us know as soon as possible if any damage occurs so we can help you find the best resources to repair it. A unique aspect of natural wood is the fact that the color of the surface changes over time due to exposure to light and air. This will vary by wood species, but variations in grain orientation or color changes will not be considered a defect, as these are expected with wood products. Like all solid wood products, changes in humidity, temperature, and other environmental factors will cause all wood countertops to seasonally expand and contract. Because of this, minor changes may occur in the countertops, but are also not considered defects, as this will vary by wood species. Now that you have the knowledge to be successful in adding wood countertops to your designs, you may want to supplement your tools with a sample kit, job-specific samples, or maybe some other informational resources. You can order these online or by emailing sales at craft-art.com. Once you have a customer interested in wood, you can quote 24 hours a day online at craft-art.com. Simply input your information and receive an instant retail quote on your screen. Or if you'd prefer to discuss the quote with our team, email us at sales at craft-art.com. Be sure to include all the necessary information to avoid delays or request this quote sheet for easy information collection with your customer. When you're ready to close a job, send us the final quote with any changes, a CAD drawing, and 50% deposit. Our sales team will produce the final shop drawings that will need to be signed by your team and returned to us to place the job into production. Once we receive signed drawings, the shipment lead time is approximately two weeks, at which point the final payment will be due for shipment. When receiving your shipment, be sure to check for damage to avoid delays in the warranty process. We custom build each pallet for our countertops and take great care to make sure they arrive to you safely. Occasionally, accidents do happen on the road and damage is usually obvious to the receiver. Look for splintered wood, torn cardboard, or broken straps, and note any damage on the bill of lading before signing it for the driver. 
If you suspect damage, open the pallet immediately and report it to your sales representative. A preferred choice for kitchen countertops, wood brings together the best of style, function, and versatility. Contrasting grain patterns and shading add to wood's natural beauty, imparting a unique appearance that can never be exactly duplicated. That's what makes us unique. We hope you'll choose craft art as a part of your next unique design. Please contact us if you have any questions, because we're here to help. Remember, if you need any additional resources, our website is a wealth of knowledge, photos, and inspiration. Visit us at craft-art.com. We also sell custom stainless steel countertops, so contact your sales representative today for more information on stainless steel. Thank you.